The world we live and play in has changed rapidly. The dynamic education landscape, coupled with rapid technological changes, has transformed the way students learn and how students can be assessed. The Singapore Examinations and Assessment Board responded to these changes by leveraging technology and data to develop engaging and authentic tests for candidates and improve operational efficiency in the conduct of examinations. We make the bold move to transform labour-intensive pen-based marking in national exams. On-screen marking was piloted in 2018 and all locally marked GC subjects such as mother tongue languages and social studies are now on-screen marked. Soon, OSM will be implemented for all PSLE subjects. OSM enhances marking quality and efficiency. Answer scripts are first scanned and then marked on-screen. A key innovation is the use of quality assurance scripts. These are pre-marked scripts that are distributed randomly among unmarked live scripts. By comparing marker scores of these scripts against the pre-marked scores, team leaders can monitor markers' marking performances. Quality assurance scripts eliminate the need for double marking in subjects with subjective mark schemes. Marking efficiency can be raised by more than 30%. Markers welcome on-screen marking. Administrative processes such as counting of scripts and telling of marks are now automated. Markers can focus on professional discussions around mark scheme application with their team leaders. OSM has made rich data accessible for analysis. For example, we can gain insights into what students can or cannot do in national examinations which will better inform curriculum policy and classroom instruction. Since 2019, coursework delivery has been digitalized. Coursework tasks are e-delivered to candidates and candidates' artifacts are submitted online for e-moderation. The initiative was welcomed by schools as it reduced the need for the transportation of artefacts to and from SEAB and helped schools to create digital archives of students' coursework. The moderation exercise at SEAB was also made more efficient as moderators could access candidates' coursework securely from their laptops. The automated storage and retrieval system has transformed examination operations. It automates the storage and retrieval of large volumes of question papers and candidate scripts, reducing the need for manpower and large storage spaces. It also enhances security and raises operational efficiency in the movement of examination material. Electronic examinations, introduced in 2013, leverage technology to bring more authenticity and interactivity in assessments to engage candidates. The use of video clips presented authentic contexts as stimulus for spoken interaction. This has been implemented in all GCE mother tongue and English language oral examinations. Video clips are also used as resource in exercise and sports science, where candidates analyze and evaluate physical movements presented in the video to respond to structured questions. Computer text input allows candidates to use the editing function to better organize their writing into concise and cogent answers. This was implemented in Mother Tongue Language Syllabus B and Mother Tongue Language and Literature. Moving forward, we will explore the introduction of interactive objects, which allow candidates to manipulate variables to respond to questions, so as to access the application of concepts in authentic contexts. We also develop assessment products that provide feedback on students' attainment of knowledge and skills. Catalytics and MathsCheck are two mathematics products introduced recently. Catalytics is a computerized adaptive test that tailors the test to each student's ability. 
It is topic based, allowing each student to determine his performance by topic and take appropriate action. Maths Check P2 and Maths Check P4 are grade level online tests for primary 2 and primary 4 students, respectively. It provides overall assessment of attainment at the end of the year. Both the Catalytics and Maths Check provide teachers with useful reports and information on where gaps are for each student in mathematics. This helps teachers to introduce appropriate interventions to help individual students to deepen their learning in specific topics or areas and close those learning gaps. I found both tools very useful in helping students, especially those who need more support in mathematics. These are transformations in test development, as well as examination administration and operations. We will continue to conduct research and develop appropriate assessments that ensure the relevancy of our students' skill sets in the dynamic global economy.